Hello, my name is Miss Rahman. I'm the head of chemistry at Ilford County High School. I have been teaching chemistry for over 11 years. Welcome to our department. The chemistry department is part of the science faculty and follows the AQA A-Level Chemistry course 7405. The course builds on the work covered at GCSE, in particular AQA Triple Science Higher Tier Chemistry. The subject has a 20% mathematical demand and we recommend that A-Level Chemistry studied alongside A-Level Maths. All other subjects complement A-Level Chemistry from the sciences to the humanities. Students will study a two-year syllabus. The course will include the study of physical, organic and inorganic chemistry and practical aspects relevant to the three branches. Students will be tested with three two-hour exams at the end of the two years. Practical skills are assessed during the completion of 12 required practicals, awarding students separately with the standalone qualification of a pass or a fail. To help secure a pass, our students complete a minimum of 20 practicals over the two years. At ICHS, chemistry is viewed as an exciting and practical subject that engages students with the knowledge of elements and processes and a sense of curiosity through problem solving and inquiry-based learning. Hi, my name is Areeb and I've been at Offer County for seven years and I'm studying Maths, Chemistry, Physics and Economics at A-Level. I decided to study chemistry at A-Level because I really enjoyed studying at GCSE and also chemistry is a very sought after um, subject by universities and also employers. Um, you learn a lot of transferable skills such as analytical skills, mathematical skills and problem solving skills as well, um, which employers and university um, really value. Hi, my name is Jafri Singhali and I'm in year 13. I've been studying at Ilford County High School for six years now and I study maths, further maths, chemistry and history at A-Level. I chose to study chemistry at A-level because I thoroughly enjoyed studying it at GCSE and lower level um, and I wanted to carry on doing something that I love. Modern advances in chemistry such as nanotechnology, development of synthetic routes for novel drugs or the research into elements in our known universe makes chemistry all the more exciting. Many famous personalities have studied chemistry, including Dame Kathleen Lonsdale, an alumni of our sixth form who contributed to the discovery of the planar nature of benzene. Chemistry provides an invaluable set of skills that are recognised both in science and non-science based careers, developing excellent analytical, mathematical, practical and problem solving skills that employers desire. Chemistry is one of the most popular A-level courses at ICHS and we are seen as a very supportive department with high expectations for all our students. Currently there are three year 12 and four year 13 groups taught by three teachers, well qualified in chemistry at undergraduate and postgraduate level. There are nine lessons over a two week timetable, including double lessons to complete practical work. ICHS has invested in a state of the art science block with new chemistry laboratories and sixth form facilities. Our department is well resourced with students having access to hard copy books and e-books on the VLE. Teachers use a variety of teaching tools such as visualizers, modeling kits and practical equipment. So something I really enjoyed at um, GCSE at Dilford County was the number of practicals that we do. Uh, and so even with COVID restrictions that's continued into A level. Today we do the continuous rate practical and we're measuring the order of reaction with respect to uh, hydrogen peroxide and we did that by mixing hydrogen peroxide with water and adding a manganese catalyst and then measuring the volume of oxygen collected. So when we measure the volume of oxygen collected we calculated from a formula the concentration of um, hydrogen peroxide and then we plotted the graph of concentration against time and then from the gradient of that graph we calculated the rate um, and we plotted that against concentration. Uh, at Ilford County, the chemistry department really pushed you to think deeply about abstract concepts and often they explain these concepts through modelling and uh, demonstrations as well as practicals as well. Chemistry can be conceptually challenging. We adopt an academic and scholarly yet fun and practical approach to learning where students are encouraged to read journals and books beyond the curriculum to engage with deep learning. For example, students are set one or two essay questions a year to improve their academic literacy and referencing skills. Students have a natural appreciation of practical science and engage well with modelling of abstract ideas. 
The department is very successful with a general pass rate of 98 to 100%, of which 35% are graded A star to A. Last year's results show an increase in A star to A grades to 48%. The chemistry department has supported me in extracurricular activities by helping me with my UCAS application, giving me interview support and preparation tips. Um, they entering me for Cambridge Challenge in Year 12, and I've currently been invited to take part in A-Star Masterclasses with the overall aim of taking part in the Olympiad in Year 13, which I'm looking forward to. The most stable students are also challenged to participate in the International Olympiad and Cambridge Challenge and attend A-Star Masterclasses. We also run regular small group interventions on key topics following topic tests and mock exams and provide one-to-one support to science-based medical and Oxbridge UCAS applicants. I was looking into biomedical engineering and I know chemistry is a, very, is a preferred subject for most universities and I think the practical aspect of chemistry would be very helpful in that subject. For further education I've decided to study economics at university. Chemistry has a lot of analytical skills and mathematical techniques that are very highly sought after for universities. Chemistry is a compulsory A-level subject for students wishing to read medicine, dentistry, pharmacy, chemical engineering, veterinary medicine or pharmacology. The subject also lends well to the study of law, banking, accounting and finance and other sciences. Chemistry is also a traditional subject popular at university opening opportunities in the chemical and pharmaceutical industry in the UK and abroad. Examples of alumni student destinations include Russell Group Universities and Oxford and Cambridge.